This is Community Connection. Thanks for joining us for this Community Connection Spotlight. We have Sydney Blair and Stephen Humphreys with the Center for Mental Health in the MTN studios this morning. Thank you both for being here. Thank you. Thanks for having us. All right, so we're here to talk about a very exciting upcoming, upcoming uh, fundraising dinner for the Center. Yes, um, July 10th is um, our first fundraising dinner and our guest uh, speaker is Josh Hustis, um, NBA player Josh Hustis, who is also from Great Falls. Wonderful. Is this the, um, you mentioned just now, uh, the first um, fundraiser dinner of its kind here in the city? Yes. Um, we were really kind of inspired by Josh's story and um, uh, of course he's, he grew up here, uh, went to school with with my sons, and um, and it, I, we really felt um, inspired by the fact that he talked. Uh, he talks a little bit about his um, his mental health struggles as um, as a youth, and um, in terms of just surviving and thriving, and of course persevering as a athlete. Wonderful, um, Stephen. Talking about um, Josh Hustis, what about his story uh, relates to the Center for Mental Health? Uh, well, I don't know Josh that well, but it's my understanding that uh, he was adopted as he was growing up, and so he had a variety of challenges, and, um, and uh, his family, from what I understand, is involved in mental health also. Mm -hmm. So that was very interesting to me. Definitely. Now, sticking with the Center for Mental Health, what services um, do you guys provide? We provide a variety of services for children clear up to seniors. Uh, our focus really is on people with a severe mental illness, uh, things like schizophrenia, major depression, bipolar disorder, uh, and also children that are having uh, some pretty serious problems in school. Um, some of them that are having enough behavioral problems and family issues that they need to be in a group home. Um, we have group homes for adults, again, mostly people with uh, pretty serious mental illnesses, uh, schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, depression, the psychotic disorders. Sure. Um, we provide psychiatry services, uh, so the medication, we provide the therapy services, um, day treatment services. Mm -hmm. Uh, really the whole gamut, anything somebody could need that's dealing with a severe mental illness, we can provide that service. Wow, and so um, getting back to the fundraising dinner, um, do proceeds benefit those services? Absolutely, they um, are going to present, they're going to help us um, to raise funds for um, our crisis homes, housing projects, and, and whatnot. All right, wonderful. Now what can guests expect from the night? So you can come at six o'clock, uh, you could, we have different individual tables sponsored by different um, um, businesses here in town. Uh, we have individual seating that, it, that you can buy tickets for or you can buy a table altogether. That, that event begins at, at uh, 6 o'clock and Josh will speak at 7. All right, wonderful. Now included in the night um, are a number of silent auction items as well. There are. Um, Josh has generously offered to sign um, um, many different kinds of shorts, t-shirts, basketballs, all sorts of great um, take-home prizes. So Wonderful. Now, those interested in attending the event, um, where can they find more information or, or get tickets? You can look at on our website, which is www.center4mh.org, and there will be everything that you can find on there. Otherwise, you can call us at 761-2100. All right, wonderful. Well, thank you both for being here and taking time out of your day. All that information can be found on our websites as well, KRTV and KXLH.com. Thank you again both for being here. Thank you. Thanks for your time. All right, thanks for watching.